Did you know that both eyes have a 130 degree field of vision? That is, your eyes are comparable to a fisheye lens. However, as a result of evolution, human peripheral vision is only really suitable for detecting moving objects, especially the Are there ways that you have wide view of the crash of the sword in the map? camera? But that's enough facts. Let's move on to the tests. Aperture Science Innovator's Glass Prototype Lens Attachment. It should help you with capturing and placing objects through glass, but keep in mind that this modifier doesn't work with reflective and frosted glass. Good luck. is possible. Some part of me is disgusted with the thought of this but but it's really possible. previous tests, so I've decided to trust you with a more powerful modifier that will allow you to scale captured objects. But don't forget, such opportunities need to be handled carefully. Don't try to photograph organic matter or parts of your own body. The results uh, could be unpredictable. You might have a question. Okay, why does the camera consist of several modules rather than being in one piece from the start? And you know what? Forget that question. You are not a qualified aperture science associate, so it's basically too difficult understand how this camera works. Your role is to follow instructions and improve test results. Try to focus on your work and don't ask too many questions. Currently the scaling amplitude is locked at 33%. That's because the working principle of the modifier is based on scaling of quantum mechanical force fields of molecules. Right? If you really do, 
have warned her about the question I mentioned before. I'll give it the answer. In layman's terms, the device is an extremely complex working principle. That's where the lab boys and I have decided to divide the camera into several parts. doing great volunteer however doing the same job non-stop for a long time may and regularly does lead to distorted results of burnout therefore you may relax in this room enjoying the stunning view of the city and a small cup of coffee you know i once asked one of my doctors tell me what is science to reply well it's what allows us to understand the world and improve human life i said no it's not what you think Science is what makes us more confident in what we don't know. you were able to solve this task. Strangely, I feel a little bit more. But don't worry. Let's continue working and move on to the next test. <laughs> 